My project is looking at the movement patterns of bottom fish by a wastewater treatment outfall at Huntington Beach. The reason why I am conducting this research is because fishers are often bringing up fish with endocrine disrupting contaminants, which kind of affect their stress response, metabolism, and biological processes. And some male fish have been developing ovotestes, which are males who have developed ovaries as well as testicles and can no longer reproduce effectively. The first step in the test to determine if fish are attracted to wastewater will involve putting things called acoustic receivers in the water. This is an acoustic receiver. It's like a giant toll booth. And we put this in the water and we tad fish with these tads in their belly. It's not harmful to the fish. We're going to be using a sedative so that the fish don't feel anything. And the fish swims near the receiver and it's picked up by the receiver and we can see where the fish has been in relation to where this receiver is in the water. Most of these bottom fish, like English sole or horny head turbot, aren't really eaten by people, but California scorpion fish are. And this can be a problem if they are around the outfall and spending a lot of time in contaminated areas, and then form these massive spawning aggregations that are fished by fishermen. It's really important that this research is done because wastewater treatment plants account for the majority of people's wastewater the Orange County Sanitation District alone accounts for 2.5 million people's wastewater. So it's really important that we see how our wastewater affects the surrounding marine environment. Once I'm done with this project, it will either be on the Cal State Long Beach Shark Lab website or also on the Staten website, which basically shows my trash fish and where they are with an interactive map. So users can follow an individual fish or they can see where the fish spend most of their time as a whole. I just think it's very important that we find out how our wastewater affects the marine environment.